Hey guys, Tucker here from 4th Mail Tech, and today we're going to be doing a full new office tour. Now this video is going to be hopefully all in one clip, and I'm just going to show you all around my office and some of the details of the new office. So let's start off on the left here. I have actually two tripods. This is the main tripod, the Magnus VT300, as well as I have a secondary one, and it's a Amibico, Amibico? I don't know how you pronounce that, but I just use that for holding me my slider, which I actually don't have in the office currently, but I will be moving that in here soon. Over here we have a chair, just an additional place to sit down, and this is the beginning of my speaker setup. Now I'll talk a little bit more about this later as we get closer to the computer, because that'll make more sense later. Up here I have a whiteboard with a little pen on top there to write down various notes and other things. Light switch. And up here I actually have something really cool. This is a laser light sort of thing. Let's see if we can turn it on real quick. I'll show you guys what this looks like. It's pretty neat when you turn it on. And as you can see all throughout the room there's laser lights going on. So I like to have sort of a party mode in the office. Now moving right along we have a full-size couch here which is really nice if you want to just lounge out maybe watch a movie on the computer or something like that and as for the artwork this one my brother actually gave to me and this graffiti over here I actually found at a garage sale and these are just kind of random art pieces I thought looked good on the wall up there we have actually another speaker behind the couch to give you that surround sound sort of style. Garbage can and a third speaker over here. And on this desk we have a little Apple remote. This is a very old school version. And this is for controlling music from my computer that goes to all three of these speakers as well as the ones over here on my desk. Kleenex box, pretty standard light here and then this is where my camera goes which I'm currently filming with and by the way apologies for the audio quality as I'm just using the inboard microphone moving along here we have a compartment and on top of this it has this tiny little drone here that I recently got so I may be doing on a video a video on that soon hopefully it's really fun to just fly around some earbuds here some charging cords. So I have an old school Apple cord. This is to charge the drone here and then this is for charging my camera. And this thing here is actually a Corky. I don't know if you can read that on the bottom there. But this is a really nice for holding cables up that go behind there for good cable management. And this here is actually a charger for a remote control car that I have which actually recently broke. So unfortunately I won't be able to do a video on that very soon, but I was thinking of doing kind of a collaboration of the drone here as well as the RC car. And moving along here we have the desk. Well, I'll start with the chair. This is just a pretty standard chair. I don't know, you could probably find it at any local office store. Not, don't actually remember where I got that. Uh, on the desk here we have large mouse pad. Just pretty standard. It's got a design on it. A Microsoft mouse here. I don't know, it works. Pretty basic. The Apple keyboard this is actually the wired one. And what's really nice about this is it has USB ports on either side. There's one on this side as well. So it acts as like a USB hub, which is very fortunate. Still rocking the Mac Mini from the last setup video. Now this has an upgraded SSD as well as some more memory and it seems to edit 1080p video very nicely. We've got an Acer monitor over here, secondary Dell monitor. This one's smaller, I use it for social media websites while I'm editing over here. Then we've got the webcam, this is a Rocketfish, I think it's 720p webcam, not sure, maybe I'll put a link for that down below. And moving here we have the speaker system. So these two speakers, the right and left one here, are the in Insigna, 
insignia speakers and this actually runs down below the desk see cable management is not my forte there we have the sub subwoofer for these down here and the cord goes all the way under I don't know if you can see the bend in the carpet there and it runs all the way to these three speakers all over the room so you get complete and full surround sound which is very very neat now let's check out what's in these drawers as I forgot to show you that in the top one here we have just a few extra electronic things some screwdrivers a floaty wristband for a camera microfiber cloth etc just random stuff next one here sunglass collection because everybody loves sunglasses you know some speed stack cups I don't know if you guys have ever heard of those but they're pretty fun to play with in the third drawer we've got a CD drive as well as a bunch of cables which I like to keep fairly neat and earbuds wrapped around that cup there and in the last one we've got some extra lighting equipment for filming videos and just extra cords in general um, back here behind the computer we've got the microphone of choice that is the blue snowball now I'm not able to use this again as I mentioned earlier in the video but this produces nice audio quality over here we've got the MacBook Pro which I use on the go love that machine as well as a actually 3D printed this headphone hook here and I really love it for just hanging my headphones off the desk these are the Sony XB300 which I did already review so be sure to check that out and lastly over here I have a just standard small Bluetooth speaker works pretty well nice for on the go audio anyway thank you so much for watching this has been my full office tour hopefully you did enjoy it if you did be sure to click that like button down below as well as subscribe for more technology videos see you in the next one